So my name is Michelle Dykstra, I'm from New Zealand, um, I'm 47 years old and I was diagnosed with um, inflammatory breast cancer and invasive ductal carcinoma. I actually found a lump in my breast um, four months ago and um, I was misdiagnosed for three months. I was actually told I had something else completely different and I only found out, I think, uh, a week before I came here that I actually had terminal cancer. Within a week I went from relatively healthy to being so ill I could barely get out of bed. It happened very, very fast. So I knew I didn't want chemotherapy, I just had a really strong feeling that it was not the right thing for me and um, I just had a, also a really strong feeling that this place was the right thing for me to do as well. I liked the sound of everything they offered. I liked the research that they'd done behind it. Um, so it just suited my, um, I guess, my ethics and my way of thinking about, you know, more holistic healing, like healing the immune system, as well as treating the cancer. And I contacted one of the customer representatives, Jessica, and she was so lovely. And um, yeah, and she sort of answered all my questions and. Um, yeah, I had a lot of questions <laughs> and um, she was great to deal with and then I got the misdiagnosis so um, I contacted her and said well I actually don't have cancer so I'm not coming now <laughs> and then it was um, only at the last minute again when I found out I had actually had cancer and it was terminal that I contacted her again and said look I need to get over there um, as soon as possible and she said look just as soon as you can get here we'll, we'll take you so. The very first day I arrived um, I met with all the doctors and nurses and um, treatment just sort of started immediately. There was no sort of taking a breath, it was just straight in and that was good actually, it was what I needed. Um, they were lovely, they were so supportive. I mean in my mind I still kind of thought I was going to die. <laughs> I didn't think I was probably going to survive and no one let me believe that. They, they just all were on board with you know keeping the positivity up and uh, well, I had a, a six-week program, and my results have been. I've just had a final scan a few days, or last week, a few days ago, and my breast tumour is now half the size. Uh, my lungs, I had four um, nodes in my lungs, and there's now two, and they've both shrunk um, to half their size as well. Um, the lymph nodes are now completely clear, and my energy is. Amazing! I'm now swimming every day. Um, I can have enough energy to actually like walk around the shops and do things. I'm not 100% yet, but I'm so much better than I was. I feel really positive about you know what's what's coming and in the future now. I feel like I've I guess been given a chance at life. Mm. If you can get the money together, then um, I would say do it. You know without. If, if, look into it, research it, and if it feels like it's the right thing to do, then you know, go for it. Contact them, talk to them, ask them as many questions as you need to. Just um, you know, get onto it and do it early. You know, the earlier you can get into these treatments, um, the better. I've seen some amazing results from people that were with me over six weeks, and um, yeah, and that gives you hope while you're here as well as watching other people who have been here for a while and then they leave and they've had their results and yeah. I'd just like to say thank you to everyone at Verita. They've, they've just been so amazing and they have just given me a chance at life that I wouldn't have had otherwise. Um, it, I, was, I was literally just going to be left to die and um, they've given me hope where I didn't have any before. So yeah, I'd just like to say a big thank you.